Seems that garfish is all the rage this week. A lot of my viewers have written into me and said, can you show us how to catch some garfish? So stay tuned and I'll uh, give you the one. <laughs> okay, catching garfish, quite simple. I'm just using a pencil float through to a little sinker that's just big enough to sink the float. I've got a swivel with a clip on it. And then from there, I've got two traces with a tiny size 10 or a size 12 hook, depending on how big the garfish are. A couple of little baits, I'm using uh, some, some silverfish, you can use pippies, you can use prawns, whatever you like. So um, stick around and watch how we do it. The main secret is have an onion bag, or I put two inside each other with some bread in there and just let the trail trickle on behind the boat. The garfish come straight up to them, they can't resist it. Okay, my float has just dipped under the water, so I've given it a little nudge. Just reel it in gently. No need to rush. Now, you'll see here, we've got a really tiny one. The one I caught earlier was much bigger, so they taste just as good, but what I might do with this one is chop it up and see if I can catch myself a pinky with it. All my rods are having a go now, so I better check them out. There are millions of these little baby pinkies around, absolutely millions of them. And these slimy trevally, looks like they've come around too. Yeah. Another little fish. Tiny little fish. The bay is absolutely full of these. Great sign for next year. That's a nice trevally. These slimy trevally absolutely smashing me. So um, you gotta play the cards you dealt. I'll catch a feed of these before I focus on the pinkies. Cause they're just taking everything that I throw in the water. So I might as well catch a feed secure lunch for tomorrow and then um, we'll play some games with the pinkies. They are absolutely crazy. Yeah, look at that. Now we caught garfish, we caught pinkies. Now this beautiful Slumetra Valley is a nice bycatch. I'm not complaining. Better than staying at home. And no corona out here. This <laughs> is such good fun. Now in case you're wondering, the bag limit on these slimy trevally is 20 and the size limit is 20 centimeters. So they're good fun, and you can really sit on them for a while, especially if you've got the kids with you. Here we go. Nibble, nibble. Now I'm catching these little yellowtail mackerel. These are awesome bait for snapper. I'm going to save these for snapper season. these little beauties. Snapper season is going to be great this year I reckon. Would you look at that. Garfish with a size 6 long shank hook. <laughs> Unbelievable mate. <laughs> what can I tell you? Uh, 
Slow and Trevelli are back. Seriously, I've got a little bit of squid on this hook and I've caught about 10 fish with it. I've caught Slimy Trevally, I've caught Garfish, and I've also caught those yellow tail mackerel. Can't, I'm not gonna say nothing. Beautiful 30 centimeter pinkies right in the middle of the day. This is getting too much. Can someone please give me a hand, please? It's no fun on my own. Well, viewers, came out for a midday session, ended up catching some lovely pinkies. I got some nice garfish, slimy trevally, and also some uh, yellowtail mackerel. Well, not bad for a midday session. If I pack up and leave now, I'll be home in time to watch the footy. I'll watch the Tigers get another win under their belt. So um, thanks for tuning in and, and watching the show. I think I deserve myself a cigar. It's Wally's World of Fishing.